Welcome back to our garden series where we explore different plant varieties and their unique qualities. Today we're going to be talking about Fakahatchee grass. Fakahatchee grass is a warm season native grass to North America. It is named after the Fakahatchee Strand Preserve State Park in Florida where it is commonly found growing in wetland habitats. It has been an important forage plant for grazing animals and has been used for soil stabilization. Fakahatchee grass is a clumping grass that can grow up to 8 feet tall and 5 feet wide. It has wide green leaves that can grow up to 2 feet long and 2 inches wide. The leaves have a rough texture and can be slightly hairy. The grass produces tall, slender seeds heads that can reach up to 10 feet tall. The seed heads are purplish brown in color and have a feather-like appearance. Fakahatchee grass grows well in moist to wet soils and is adapted to a wide range of soil types. It prefers full sun to partial shade and can grow in USDA zones 6 through 10. It is a low maintenance plant and is drought tolerant once established. Fakahatchee grass can be used in rain gardens, wetland areas, and other water features. It can be planted with other native grasses, sedges, and rushes to create a diverse wetland habitat. It can also be planted as a buffer around waterways to help filter and absorb excess nutrients and pollutants. Fakahatchee grass is primarily used as a forage plant for grazing animals, such as cattle and horses. It has also been used for soil stabilization in wetland areas and for erosion control on slopes. Its dense root system helps to anchor soil and prevent erosion. Additionally, it can be used in landscaping to create a natural looking low maintenance area that attracts wildlife. Fakahatchee grass is also a host plant for various butterfly species, including the zebra swallowtail and the spice bush swallowtail. And that's it for today's episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more gardening tips and information. Thanks for watching.